going on, Fizzles and Joe, Colts Make Dash, and welcome back to my own investigations. It's time to ask the mayor for a search warrant. We have pl probable claws, mostly due to that cutscene, but something tells me that we're going to have to do like a confrontation or find some bullshit evidence because it's a game. Let's talk to her. Mayor, we need your help with something. We have reason to suspect that the Diamond Dogs were involved with the crime against Rarity last night, and we need a search warrant to let us search their caverns. Yeah, she, yeah, she looks like she's going to resist. Did I do that right? Twilight, to begin, what evidence do you have that this is the case? Uh, a, a whole lot? Well, a ripped stool in the carousel boutique, and trampled grass outside the carousel boutique? We have a whole lot more than that. Uh, well, first of all, mention that the, the stool was ripped by a claw from a diamond dog, and also the behavior of the guard. And oh. this implicates the diamond dogs. How? Uh, Twilight's a moron. I... <laughs> I guess it doesn't really, does it? Twilight, Twilight's an idiot in this game. She can't, like, you know, presenting the white hair to Scootaloo should work, but she can't, for some reason, like, just goes, Oh, this piece of evidence suggests that you... Don't something, and she's like, she screws it up. Sheesh. Yeah. I liked the mayor back when she seemed incompetent. Even if you had evidence, Twilight, that brings us to the second point. You aren't acting in any official capacity. I can't very well just give a search warrant to any ordinary citizen. But well, we make don't me have a, any pony make me like a detective. That. Well, yes. Hence the reason why we're bringing in a team from Canterlot. Honestly. Twilight, it would do you some good to pay attention. Oh god, the Canterlot team. Uh, well, we can address the issue that I'm not an investigator later. Right now, we need to fix the evidence problem. We don't have an evidence problem, really, but... She's right. I don't have solid evidence that would cast suspicion on the Diamond Dogs. Yeah, you do. You're just too stupid to actually bring it up. I don't believe there was much else around the boutique. Perhaps we should... Go back to the cabin entrance and see if we can find anything there? No okay. better ideas over here. Let's go. Uh, what about the ribbon? Uh, the search warrant. Yeah, oh, the Canal oh, Investigative Twilight. Team. That reminds me. I heard some rather wonderful news from the investigative team in Canterlot. Oh, what is it? Really? Were they delayed? Please say they were delayed. I need more time. They're going to get here sooner, aren't I'm they? I'm pleased to report that they wrapped up their current case earlier than expected, and will be here yep. tomorrow instead of a few days' time. Isn't that great? Yeah, great. Oh, tomorrow? <laughs> Cock is ticking, Twilight! Right? Cock Ready, is let's ticking! Go right now! We have a case to solve! Is she alright? Yeah, she's fine. I'm sure she'll be fine. Eventually. Okay, so we have to present two pieces of evidence for the search warrant. Um, let's see, the... Well, Opal's ribbon seems like some solid evidence, as well as the stool, so let's see, maybe I already have them. Mayor, I hate to say it, but I can't find any decent evidence casting suspicion on the Diamond Dogs for the theft of the True Blue. However, I do have evidence casting suspicion on them for a different crime. And Opal. what would that be? The True Blue wasn't the only thing stolen last night. Opalescence was also stolen as well. And I have reason to suspect that it was the Diamond Dogs who did it. This is a serious accusation, Twilight. What evidence do you have? The we ribbon. Found this ribbon, which is Opal's, right outside the Diamond Dogs' caverns. Hmm, intriguing. But I'm afraid that this is just not good enough, Twilight. What? Come now, Twilight. This could have easily just blown there if it had come off on its own. It's not a very heavy material. If you don't have anything that relates directly to the Diamond Dogs, I don't think I can do anything here, I'm afraid. Uh, okay. I need something else, then. Back to the investigation. So does that take at least one lock off? That took one lock off. What about the stool? Does that take the other lock off or the hook or the hook gems? Um, see, either one of them. Twilight, I'm very busy right now. I can't be bothered with something like that. How many birthdays do you have to plan for exactly? 
Okay, that didn't take anything off. Uh, what about the hooked gems? Twilight, I'm very busy. Okay, that's not it. Um, see, what else is there that could potentially be it? What about the small Twilight, gems, maybe? I'm very busy. No. Rarity said to go investigate outside the the thing. Uh, what if I present the diamond Twilight, dogs? Please. Um, no. Okay. I don't think any of the rest of the stuff is gonna do me any good. Rarity said to investigate by the diamond dogs cavern. I, assu I assume that one of them, at, le at least, was the ribbon that she was referring to. Maybe can we go the other way now? Uh, Twilight, not to intrude, but I am not quite sure where you're going. No, that doesn't work. So anything else in the area? Let's see if I search. There's nothing. Um, what if I search out here? This is where we found Opal's thing. It's not lighting up though, so I guess let's see. No, nothing else here. What else? What could it possibly be? I don't know, I don't, I, there's nothing else in this area. Um, may, maybe it's something that I already have, like with, like with the ribbon. Uh, I think I'll just go, go, you know, go through the entire list and, uh, say, so yeah, let's put this away. And I'll come back when, you know, if any of them work or not work. Twilight, forgive my curiosity, but why are you doing all this? Okay, so that line was triggered by presenting myself, but I don't think I'm going to imagine oh, it's not going to actually work. Mare? Well, taking on this case, of course. I can't say I've ever seen a pony actively want to take on a case like this. Although, I suppose this doesn't happen very often, either. Nope, since it's all magic <laughs> friendship and whatnot. I can't tell her that Scootaloo is the prime suspect, because it's the right thing to do. And I don't think that investigative team is going to get to the bottom of things. May I ask what you have against them, Twilight? They've only falsely accused Pinkie Pie of three crimes so far. Can't they be <laughs> just like? Yeah. Not even gonna dignify that with a response. Nope. Okay, I'm gonna go back to presenting other evidence. Uh, I'll come back in a sec. Ah, oh, Rarity! Oh, Rarity I works. I to talk to you. Whatever is the matter, Mayor? The Candlelight investigative team will need the crime scene completely untouched for them to properly conduct their investigation. I just wanted to make it clear that you should not touch anything around your boutique until they're done. Yeah, do you look oh, that? Uh, <laughs> right, of course. I shall be sure to keep that in mind. Is there a problem, Rarity? Ah! <laughs> not at all! Don't be silly! Oh boy. Just don't come by to check in there. All right, time, time to get back to presenting other evidence. Uh, Twilight, I don't mean to pry, but I haven't seen Scootaloo in a little while, now that I think about it. Is anything wrong? That's presenting Scootaloo. Yeah. What do I say? Uh, she's preoccupied with other things? Other things like what? Um, things that make her not here. <laughs> I imagine they're pretty important. Oh, she's nowhere. Well, I hope she shows up soon. I've been getting a little worried. <sighs> that was close. Yeah, I figured, I figured that presenting her would do something like that. Let's get back to presenting other ponies. Okay, nothing else worked, so we're gonna need some sort of other evidence. We can't combine anything in, uh, because of the, the thing's not lighting up. See, can I go this way now? Uh, there's still the big crowd blocking it. Really, oh crap, I accidentally you talked to Rarity. Um, so... I, I don't know if she had anything important to say. So, what do I do? I don't, I don't know what I could have possibly missed. I think I may just end up looking up that walkthrough. Just, like, god, the, the music here. Yeah, I, th I mean, I could search around, but it would take forever. To, you know, search every last inch. Although, I guess... It might be it might be worth just running through every area with Rarity's thing. I don't want to talk to every single pony. That would take forever. Uh, can we leave, please? Yeah. Is it in? I mean, well, I think I've pretty much gone through every every area with Rarity in the party at this point. That's open to us. So you, you know what? I think I'm just gonna look up a walkthrough. I don't I don't really want to talk to every single pony. Okay, I'm back. And uh, according to the walkthrough, what we were supposed to do is go back down to the cave and uh, click on Rover and see that he has some white hair on his back. Oh, wait, whoa, what's this little thing? Is that, it's just nothing? 
So I guess I'll go do that. And see, I don't see any. So but... nice, um, weather we're having, isn't it? Uh, what? You know, clouds and sunshine and stuff. Oh, weather. Do you know why this morning is talking to me? No. <laughs> that guard. Wait a second. There we go. Some white hair on his back. This hair definitely isn't that dog's. I feel like I've seen it before. White hair number two. White strands of hair found in Rover Shack and in the entrance of the Diamond Dog Caverns. And exit. And oh, we have evidence. Uh, let's see. Combine. I assume we combine that with something. We'll combine it with the original white hair? Yep. These two bits of hair definitely look the same. That's almost certainly Opal's hair on a dog's back. Interesting. So they ha so they have so they have Opal's hair. White hair number two is a uh, white strand of hair found in Robert's jacket and the of the dive dog house. So it's now likely from Opalescence. So. Hmm. Well, I think I have about all the evidence I can get to convince the mayor of the Diamond Dog's involvement. I sure hope this works. I should get back to town hall. Okay, so we so we have to go present another evidence thing to in order to get her to unlock the search warrant. So let's go do that. Okay, Mayor, present evidence. White hair number two. All right, Mayor. You wanted more evidence? I've got more evidence. We found hair just like this on a diamond dog's back. It's Opal's. It has to be. We know it has to be. We found Opal's ribbon just outside their cavern, too. Don't you think it's at least reasonable to suspect the Diamond Dogs of having a part in Opal's disappearance? All right, Twilight. She's just like, huh? I suppose you have a point. Okay, let's talk to her about a search warrant. I will grant that by this point in time, you have certainly established reasonable suspicion of the Diamond Dogs. And also, of course, they have a pretty big motive to uh, steal However, True Blue. Uh, what now? She's not an official investigator. There is still the issue, Twilight, that you are not an investigator. <sighs> right. That. Twilight, the team from Canterlot will be here soon enough. Why are you doing all of this? Because they suck. Because they couldn't solve their way out of a paper bag. This is serious business, and if they get involved and take over, there's no way we'll get to the bottom of this. There must be something you can do. <sighs> if I may interject, Mayor? By this time, Twilight has already rung the truth, to use a base expression, out of several ponies already, and has found and learned a great deal about this case. I had my doubts, but if my word counts for anything around Ponyville, I, for one, now have complete confidence in Twilight Sparkle's investigative abilities. Well, I suppose if we do not have a police force in Ponyville, that would make me the closest thing Ponyville has to such a thing. It's rather unorthodox, but if you absolutely will not let this go, then I suppose I could use my position as mayor of Ponyville to make you an official Ponyville investigator. Temporarily, at least. You... Really? Yay, <clears throat> we're an official investigator. Twilight Sparkle, by the power vested in me as mayor of Ponyville, I hereby offer you the, temporary of course, position of official Ponyville investigator, and all the responsibilities and duties expected therein. Yay! Do you accept this position? I, er, <clears throat> well, I mean, that is, oh, to heck with it. Just yes. say yes. yes, yes, yes. One yes would have done. <laughs> uh, lag. Which is to say, I, um, accept. <laughs> just, uh, just, uh, that face. Just don't make me regret this, Twilight. You won't, Mayor. I promise. So, short, a search warrant author authorizing Twilight Sparkle to investigate the Diamond Dog Caverns under suspicion of their involvement in the kidnapping of Opalescence. Okay, All let's right, go Diamond talk Dogs. to them. Your time is up. Back to the caverns. Alright, I suppose that's all we can do with Mayor Mayor, and it's time to head back to the Diamond Dogs Caverns. So, 
I will go to the Diamond Daleks Caverns and uh, present to them with the search warrant. Do I? Pre I wonder. Do I present Rover or the guard? Probably the guard. All right, dog. I'm. There back. we go. I'll see that. Go on. Not this time. I have your precious search warrant right here. My precious. What? Give me that. Uh huh. Pony, tell me you are not seriously accusing us dogs of catnapping. Yep, we are. Uh, why? Are, I have no idea why a dog would ever nap a cat. I most certainly am. Move aside. I'm coming in. <sighs> fine, fine. You will search what you must for catnapping, and then you will leave quickly. They're definitely not cooperating. All right, let's head in and see what we can find. Opal! Opal! Mama's here to rescue you! Where are you? Rarity, I don't think she's just going to come when you call. And well, here she these comes. These cabins are so expensive! And it's all dank in here! It's going to ruin my mane! Oh my god. Oh, just get the search over with and move! Just! Okay, let's look around. So that goes to room. That goes to living quarters. Uh, there's nothing else here. Okay, we're at a fork in the road. So I think uh, that seems like a good opportunity to, uh, to end the video. So what, I think I'll take the room fork first in the next video. I am Egghead Sparkle and Rarity, and I'm out.